Hi beaches and curls, welcome back for another video. And in today's video, we are going to talk about another skincare system. And this one is really good, you guys. I do have some favorites and I do have some suggestions that I am going to share at the end of this video. So without further ado, let's hop into the video. Today, I'm going to be talking about another skincare system. And this video is sponsored by Sonich. And I love the whole like makeup of this company. I love this brand. Sonage, the name Sonage is in French, is translated to look well or look great for one's age. So I really love this. They are cruelty free. They are non-toxic. They're natural products. They're natural skincare. So this is a little bit different than I have done before in the past. These are ones that are great for the environment. These are recycled after their uses, the packaging. So it's eco-friendly. And I love the fact that these are customized for your skincare. And I really did enjoy these products. I am going to share with you at the end of this video an overall review what my favorites are and some suggestions that I will want to give in terms of the product. So without further ado, let's get straight into the skincare. So the first thing we're going to start off with is the Tulsi Soothing Tri Clay Mask. I absolutely love this. I use this for spot masking. It's that time of the month, y'all, you know. So you'll see it, me put it in trouble areas where I've maybe had pimples or some breakouts, and then I'm going to put it on my nose. This is where I get a lot of congestion of blackheads and whiteheads. So you definitely want to use it around that area. I leave the mask on for about five to 10 minutes, and then I rinse it off before it dries completely. But this is really soothing. I really like this mask. The next thing I'm using is the Soothing Cleansing Cream. I like that these are color coded too, if you notice in just a few minutes, but this is a cream. It does not foam. And I tend to like to use a towel to wipe off a product just because I tend to, I feel like I get more of the grime and dirt off my skin. Next, I'm using the Glow to Go. This truly is a glow to go type of product. These are exfoliant peels. It is a chemical peel and I'm just wiping it all over my face. The next is the Soothing Mist. Is you, If you notice, everything is green in this category. They do have separate skincare systems, but this one is customized for me. And then I'm going in with my Luster Cream. I think every person, every man, every woman needs a good eye cream. This one is really soothing and very moisturizing, I noticed. And I'm putting it also in my smile lines. Next, you wanna go in with a vitamin C serum and your moisturizer. Now, I mixed mine together because I really wanted to condense. This is something that I do when I am in a hurry. But if you notice in the terms of application, I'm going in an upward and outward motion. You definitely want to go upward with your skincare. You never want to pull up and down or tug back and forth. You want to go in an upward motion. Basically, I'm going in the direction of where the muscles are in my face, and we don't want to help gravity with its job, right? So finally, uh, the next product is the SPF. This will conclude the daytime routine but I'm just gonna take it and pat it into the skin just for protection, just to cover the entire face. Okay, so I showed you guys my daytime routine. Let me show you what I would do at night. I would use an oil cleanser and then I would go in with the smoothing cleansing cream. And then I would go in, the next thing I love to do is to, you can tone again, I love the soothing mist it calms redness and balances and refreshes you can use this again if you want to or you can go in to your eye cream you definitely want to use your eye cream day and night and that's the luster eye cream and then 
you want to go in from thinnest to thickest. So I use my Olaplex Lightning Serum and then I use my High Endurance Cream. Now, the cream is a lot thicker than the souffle. And I love the fact if you feel like one is thinner than the other, at night you wanna go for your thick creams. Those are the ones that you want to really penetrate the skin at the end of the day. So I really do enjoy this. And I love the fact that they checked all the boxes with the skincare system. And I love how my face feels. It's not tacky, it feels nice. You know, and these are spa quality products. I just want to say that I totally enjoy reviewing these products, especially from the spa. I also showed you some techniques on how to, you know, to keep the skin lifted and firm as well, because it's just not only the skincare, it's the technique. It's the same with makeup and my hair videos. Technique plays a large part in application and the product really working for you at its optimal you know state so so i am back i kept my makeup to a minimum i mean this is like the bare bare minimum i did not go glam the skincare like this i know that i'll have really good makeup days which is i'm all for when i don't have to wear much and it's very light it's not heavy you know sometimes skincare can be very heavy and it absorbs really fast so i really do enjoy that <laughs> Okay, so I'm running a little bit behind, but I wanted to come back and let you guys know what my favorites were. Definitely the SPF, the eye cream, the vitamin C serum. You got to have that in your skincare routine. Like I said, all of these are essentials. Not necessarily sonage, but you definitely want to do this, but I really like these. My skin feels balanced. I don't know if that makes sense. It feels like, like even around my nose, I feel like usually i get oily around that area and i feel like everything is normal this brings it back to a normalcy i hope that makes sense and i think that's what's really important about a skincare routine i definitely love the moisturizers moisturizers are my favorite this tulsi soothing mask this is so i underestimated this 100 percent and i really really do enjoy it you can use it all over the face if you're oily but or acne prone but if you have like normal to dry skin like i do you can put it in certain areas and spot mask like i said and this would be perfect um the glow to go i really like these glycolic acid peel pads this is great for radiance and i really really like this soothing mist it calms redness and it has sage lavender rosemary i love that they have botanicals in all of them and at the bottom it tells you what it is supposed to do so though this is my overall review of it i really do enjoy it as a skincare system however i do have some favorites and i feel like the only thing i'm missing is a pre-cleanse which is like an oil remover i really wish that the skincare system would have had that with it it would have been perfect if it would have had a pre-cleanse like an oil cleanser to remove makeup because i feel like this this is amazing it has almond shea butter and apricot in it and this is the the cleansing cream i'm talking about but it did not have anything to like remove makeup um i really do enjoy this if you don't wear makeup then that could be something that you could go in maybe twice with, but you definitely want to have something to remove the makeup first and then going with a cleanser like that. And I love that it's a not, this one does not foam. I'll leave links down below to everything. And I also want to leave a link so you guys can check out each and every product. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, ladies.